Mario, Nintendo's long-standing and lovable mascot. Don't you just want to punch him in his big stupid face? No, don't you want, like, Sonic to punch him in the face? Well, now with Super Smash Bros. on the 3DS, you can do, you can see how that, that can happen. You just gotta buy the game, pop it into your 3DS, open it up, and there you go. Ah, it's like music to me. And to you, probably, as well. And with this version being on the 3DS, now you can take Smash Brothers anywhere. While waiting for the train. While waiting for the bus. What do you mean we only have two on-location shots? How hard is it to film on-location? Now, the game features some of Nintendo's classic characters. But, like many Smash Brothers games before it, it also features a couple of guest characters. It also features the return of a fan favorite. Mewtwo. There you are, baby. The game also features my personal favorite fighters, the Mii Fighters. Who do you want to make? The President? Done. Taylor Swift? You got it. Jackie Chan and Batman. Of course. What about Gandhi? Funny thing, if you make a Gandhi Mii, he won't fight because he's a man of peace. True story. You can even make a... a horse? Oh, no. Okay, this video is starting to get weird, so let's just get to the main points here. Little Mac is way too overpowered, Mewtwo is still floaty, and if done right, Yoshi can inflict some serious damage on other players. Just ask my friends. Bottom line, it's a great game for kids, adults, even Grandma. Why don't you visit anymore? I'm sorry, Grandma, I just, I got this new job and I really got- There you go, pick up a copy of Smash at your local CEX. Do it, it's great. Hey Dylan, what do you think of Smash Brothers? I love it. <laughs>